That is Savior by Lights. Hey, everybody, this is Tad Jessup, and as you are well aware, I had quite the accomplishment happen to me this weekend. I have finally, well, the, the steps are in place. I am finally learning how to ride a bike, and I was finally biking on my own this Saturday down at the Salt Sox uh, in preparation for pedaling for Parkinson's. It's going July 11th to the 13th. I'm riding on the 12th, and uh, it's all about raising money for Parkinson's research. In fact, I've got my second bike lesson tonight uh, with Peter Iskavan down there at the Salt Sox at 615 if anyone wants to come out and cheer me on. Uh, but aside from Peter, the other co-founder of uh, pedaling for Parkinson's joining me right now, Dave Dave Newell. How's it going, Dave? It's going great, Ted. Thanks for having me on. Oh, it's so great for you joining me today. And uh, it, 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 it's great to hear about this. And uh, we're learning more and more about the ride for Parkinson's as uh, time goes on. How did you become involved? Well, Pete and I have been uh, longtime friends. We've been boxing for years. Uh, my father uh, was diagnosed a number of years ago with Parkinson's. And Pete and I put our heads together to um, come up with a way to combine what we love to do with raising money uh, for Parkinson's. And, and the ride, uh, the funding from the ride goes directly into scientific research that should one day lead to a uh, cure. 100% of the funds for raised head um, go towards the scientific research. Beautiful. And, uh, you know, that's really good to know because so many people, they'll sponsor a rider or something like that, but they won't exactly know where the money is going to. But it's all going to find a cure. And how close do you think doctors are? Well, Ted, you know, that's uh, it's far be it for me to speculate. Um, you know, it's uh, every day we make progress. And uh, interestingly, we have raised enough money, Ted, that we've been able to um, have a grant. And that grant uh, allows us to select from a number of participants, scientific researchers um, at uh, institutions like University of Toronto, who are dedicated toward um, finding a cure. And, uh, you know, it's, uh, we heard from um, the recipient of the Pedaling for Parkinson's grant uh, recently, and it's amazing the progress that they're making. So um, all we can do is just continue to um, uh, raise money and support the cause. Beautiful. Well, you know what? It is a great cause, and uh, it's a great event. And uh, as a seasoned cyclist, i got, I, I, I got to ask you a couple of uh, bike questions before I let you go as a novice. Okay, so after I did my little uh, bike ride with uh, Peter on Saturday, I only did about three kilometers, but my rear end really hurt from that seat. And I was feeling pains and muscles that I've never used before. Going uh, forward, how the heck am I supposed to deal with this? So I guess it's just practice makes perfect then, huh? It is practice makes perfect. Yeah, there's, there is uh, there, there's no, fortunately, there's no silver bullet, man. Oh, that's all right. Well, you know what? I'm enjoying riding. I'm seeing what cyclists get out of it now, that high that cyclists get when they go on a really long ride. Even if a really long ride for me is three kilometers, it's still, it's still something, but I do see what you guys go through. Um, and it's a great cause, July 11th to the 13th here in Perry Sound. We've got information all over our Facebook page about it. Sponsor a rider and help find a cure. Uh, Dave, thank you so much for joining me today. Dad, thanks for having me, and uh, and thanks for giving Pedaling for Parkinson's the profile that you have. Much appreciated.